So guys, I'm currently driving along the DSC Expressway, trying to navigate my way down to Uti Road, where they are doing some massive construction of uh, roads and the drainages along the Uti Road. So guys, you know, in the course of uh, uh, Julius Berger constructing that road in the uh, that road and bridge in DSC runabout down to every runabout. The state governor, Right Honorable Sheriff of Boriwori, mentioned it that all the link roads that connect to the runabout will be done in no distance time. And uh, it is evidenced by this uh, Uti road because this particular road. It's one of the link roads that link PTI road down to a foreign about and at the same time DSC Express Way, which uh, if you are head up, maybe in a hold up in a PTI road, you can easily pass that uh, this this road and come out to DSC runabout. So guys, I decided to come out this afternoon to see what has been done so far by the contractor handling this uh, project. You see, so and from all indication, the contractor has uh, done very well. He, he has. Uh, meet up here with the standard we got from the roads and the drainage that we are seeing here show that the contractor is equally up to date and we were able to finish the work within the nearest uh, possible time because this same contractor are equally working in uh, the other side of a uh, uti PTA road, doing some uh, passion of a road and uh, what have you. And I believe from all education that shows that the contractor is uh, is equal to the uh, uh, task, and they were able to deliver within the nearest uh, possible time. So like that man you are seeing there now, he refused to speak to me. On camera, he only referred me to his uh, project manager, so I decided to to go about my normal vlog that I'm doing. You see, so guys, look at the the vlog that we are seeing the the road. You see that some feeling has gone far. In this particular area apart from this uh, place that you are seeing here i think this is the remaining place that uh, was left from the san philly but while i was there i found out that steepers were bringing in uh, sand and uh, the the other caterpillars were doing their work as they are known best so guys so let me showcase to you how the project is taking place and how the project is moving on and I believe uh, this project that was initiated by the predecessor of uh, of right honorable sheriff Boriwari which has to do with uh, Senator Dr. Infa Yokoa has uh, gone very far because I know some years back there were a lot of uh, construction of drainages and uh, uh, other pedestrian bridges by this same uh, uh, company and other company that I cannot mention their name at this very particular moment. They were involved in the construction of drainages 
and everywhere then was just like a construction site. You come to this Uti Road, that and the other side of the Uti Road, you will see that the whole place was filled with a caterpillar doing one form of construction or the other. You see, and this governor has, I think he has equally lived up to expectation because if you are to be some governors, they will just decide to abandon project that they inherited from their predecessor. But I can remember vividly that the this governor when he took when he assumed office on the day of swearing in he made mention of it that worry and ever on he will make sure that he beautify worry and environ to the international standard so that when somebody come to worry and ever wrong. If you have been away for a long time, you will even get lost until you are told that please you are you are in the rightful place. So guys, that is why I decided to take out this uh, vlog and show you people in this particular area. You see. So guys. So let me show you what is currently taking place in this uh, Uti Road. See that all the gutters have been constructed. The roads, there are some filling at the moment. That is to tell you that work is taking place. And this very particular area has been some filled already with uh, sand and uh, they have put uh, stone bees on this particular area that I'm currently showing you now. You see, you see some of all those uh, unwanted uh, materials or sand that we dug out of that uh, out of the road you see them heaping along the sideway of the road just after the drainage so that one is to tell you that uh, massive work has taken place in this particular area for those of you who are used to this particular area this place is called the uh, Uti Road extension where you have the winners uh, church and equally the the gariki you have all these uh, northern people the where they normally have their cow and their they call it uh, outside quarters according to our local uh, language you see this is very close to the place in fact this is the winners i'm be talking about you see then the other side of it which is opposite is the gariki that was that i'm talking about this is that place you are seeing over there now it's where you see all these uh, people with trailers with with their cow in fact it's a, it's a small community of its own where you have all these uh, northern people clustering in this particular area so that is the samples of uh, winners uh, chape you see so guys so let me show you so that uh, you see this particular area and uh, i think i have to give a uh, kudos to the governor for this uh, marvelous work that he has done at this particular moment because some people will say a big not get tangere let me start on that project but this project that was started by the former governor of the state in fact, Yokowa and uh, Sheriff Borori has continued from where he stopped. I think it's a good uh, omen on the current uh, governor for doing what is uh, right and what is good in the sight of everybody in the state. So, guys, that is why I decided to showcase this particular video to you people so that you will see it what the what is take, currently taking place in this particular area and you know from the other side where you have a, a free run about down to DSC run about you know mass of massive construction is taking place at the other side in the I think I remember in one of my videos that I I did I talked I talk about uh data state and the uh, and the uh, massive construction that is taking place in uh, the area so guys as you can see 
every year people are moving left and right here and there so i believe this uh, video has a uh, added value to your your site and uh, i pray that you should like this uh, video and always uh, comment at the comment section below so that we have uh, a lot of uh, engagement between me and yourself that is watching this uh, video so guys i believe by so doing youtube will promote my video to other people around the globe so guys i believe you are doing well by watching this video So these are the, the core area of the Gariki I was talking about. If you see, look at this place left and right. You see the clusters of all these uh, northern uh, people in this particular area. You see. So guys, that is why I decided to show you this particular area. Thank you for watching. I think this is the other side of the Commissioner Road. Then straight, you are going down to the Kor Uti Road, where construction have been done in the past. Massive construction have been done in the past in that area. Remaining this part that I'm showing you now. And so, guys. I am in a popular area of uh, Uti Road. They call this place uh, Gariki Road in Uti, a uh, area of the uh, Delta State in the local government area. I'm trying to give an update of uh, what I am seeing on ground as per the, the drainage and the construction of roads in this uh, vicinity. So, guys. That is why I decided to come up this, uh, this day to have a little glimpse of uh, what is happening in this uh, area. Because I discovered that there have been a massive uh, construction of drainages and uh, construction of roads. From all indications, the road has been sand filled, and every year has been sand filled, apart from one little uh, portal at the other side that we we are seeing and guys with this i believe the booty road will soon be open up for the construction that is taking place in the front through your local government area we normally call this place a front worry because it's a suburb of a worry and it's part of the worry environment so guys, that is why I decided to come out this afternoon to come and showcase what is happening in this area to you guys. So guys, as you can see, the state government, the state government have been doing uh, some massive work, even on the other side of the uh, express from uh, PT, from DRC run about down to a uh, phone run about. You've seen that the Los Vegas is doing some uh, Massive uh, construction over there, and this uh, construction company, Roadway Construction Limited, has been doing a very massive work in this area. That is why I decided to come and showcase this uh, massive work that is being done by the governor of uh, Beta States. That will be for the whole world to you guys. So, guys, as I was saying, that is the reason why I decided to come and make this uh, vlog to you guys to see. What is currently happening in uh, the front area of uh, Beta State? This blog is all about uh, showcasing or giving an update of uh, what is currently taking place in uh, the front area of Beta State. The massive work that is taking place by the has been done by the governor of the state, right honorable Sheriff Ogoruwori. In fact, this project started from the time of uh, Governor Okowa. And uh, and they have to extend down to this uh, current uh, government. And the current government, you know, if you remember at this uh, inaugural speech, she said that 
is going to change the face of a worry area. And I believe that is where he stands, and that is what he's doing in a better state. So guys, I believe uh, this video has uh, created value to you guys. And I will always appeal to you guys that always uh, share, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and like. Like if you consider that to the right for you guys. So guys, please always like my videos so that my video can be shared to other parts of the world. Thank you. See you in my next video.